that is my gorgeous, gorgeous singer. I paint, clean it really good, and this is what I'm using a um, very sharp uh, wire brush, and I'm using this hammer too to knock knock down some of the loose paint too that helps and uh, with the brush too and then I'm cleaning it really well with some rugs wow this is coming out really really fast <laughs> So I need to take this glass down and focus on that and I'm going to just uh, focus on taking this loose paint out. Uh, looks like I'm going to be here for a while. It's coming out really well. But I'm not going to exaggerate to be here too long because honestly I'm not trying to make it brand new again I'm, um, I'm doing my best to clean it really so. I bought this baby in Italy I'm now in South Florida I bought it when I used to live there for my local Italian neighbor. I bought like four of them. Since I own a, uh, a workroom, sewing workroom, this was uh, something that represents who I am, that's why I said. So, I'm just um, use them as back backyard decor. The table and stuff. So wow, it's coming out pretty well. Probably a nice pressure washer will work too. Uh, but I need to get this done fast. Oh. So let me do this all the way, and then I'll show it to you after. Welcome back. Ooh, I'm very tired. Um, I spent about 45 minutes here to take out all this rust and uh, it came out better than I anticipated. All this rust is coming out so well and now I'm going to use the water hole and uh, then I'm going to paint it red. Yeah, that's right. As I'm playing around with these paints and accessories, um, I just painted this black, right? But I'm going to make red cushions because I don't have no cushions for it. I'm going to make some red cushions. And I previously did these red cushions the other day for, um, for my other area right there. And as I'm looking around, I think... Uh, this table will look amazing in red. Um, I had that vision a long time ago, but then as I was doing this black, I said, let me just make it all matchy match. But honestly, I think this is my only time to take a chance with the red paint since I'm making the red cushions. You know what I'm saying? Coordination. So let's get this started. Right now, I'm gonna water hold the. the I have it ready here. I have this already here. Um, by the way, by the way, take a look at the brush. It's nothing left out of it. <laughs> I, I knocked it down pretty good. So you can see how much rust I took out. Whew, you can see it right there. All that is the rust that I took out. And yes that's the only way you can get beautiful things done with, with uh, 
some muscle put some muscle in there give it all you have so I'm just gonna keep cleaning this and I'll see you tomorrow bye guys guys here we are the day after well two days after I after I clean this table here and I'm about to start painting the base I'm going to find a spot uh, to where to spray paint, uh, paint so I don't get everything red but this is what I'm what this is what I'm using I have two of these cans mm, color is apple red satin I was going for a matte but I couldn't find it so I got what I got so it's Rust-Oleum paint plus pr primer so I hope these two cans are gonna be plenty so now let me find a spot uh, where to set up and I'll see you then okay so there she is um, and as you remember I clean it really well I already dusted again one more time so I'm going to shake this really well and then you're gonna see me working um, not much talk because I'm not gonna have much to tell you about I'll just go and spray it Okay. So I almost covered it all with one hand, uh, but not quite. As you can see, I'm almost done, almost done. Wow, that's a gorgeous red. Absolutely love it. Let me pick up the other can. So here I am on can number two, starting out. I'll finish that, um, what I have left on the machine, and then I come back later and do the second coat when it's... Uh... And there she is, there she is. So exciting, so exciting. That is my gorgeous, gorgeous singer. Um, okay, just to keep you updated, I end up not putting the second coat of paint or polyurethane yet. Um, since I'm in a rush to get this uh, event going, I'm gonna do it in a few days, I guess. By that time, it's gonna be perfectly dry, and that's gonna be probably even a better time to apply the second coat. Um, also check out my other video I just finished uh, making this round uh, custom cushions as well I just finished made in the other cushions of the black chairs armchairs um, also painted this table from a clear glass I painted a black check out my other video and I've done a lot a lot more these days I'm getting ready for this event, so I'm putting some things together. Also done these cushions. Um, take a look at this uh, this thing in here. Isn't that gorgeous? Here's another bass, by the way, another singer. And uh, I'm trying to create some additional seatings for my, my party. Um, and I had to bring the height up there. I created that skirt uh, in order to to uh, to raise this this table for the height up. Um, anyways, lots a lot of things going on. If you have any questions, let me know. Here is some temporary temporary seats. Um, to go with my all white party coming up this weekend uh, as we talking as we are talking I want to show you another sewing machine base um, I forgot this name uh, what's the name of that one 
Um, can't really. Um, so yeah, uh, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask me below. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. If you find it useful and would like to see more of this type of videos, please consider subscribing.